Now we're going to create a project. Here again, toolbox and the projects tab. You see the briefcase here, which you also find up here in the navigation bar where you have the advanced search for projects. But now we keep to the toolbox and the briefcase. And here you see all projects that are existing in the system. To create a new one, you will go up here on the left corner. We have a little drop down menu. Click there and then you click here, new project and the project window opens up. And it's all empty because there, is, there isn't anything in the project yet. We haven't done any bookings or anything. So what you start with is that you give your project a name. Now I'm just going to call it the post job job. The project will get a project number. If you have divisions, you can select a division. And then the important thing is that you always need to connect the project to a client that you would already have in your database in contacts, contacts you have up there. So if you click here, you can start typing the name of the client and you will find it in this list. Or if it is a new client, you can click here to create a new client and it takes you to the client window. This is the personal contact here and out here you will have the company name. I will take someone that we already have in the system here. Uh, we will take, uh, let's see here, who we will take? Maya for Maya Pix. If you would have had an ID for the client, the number would come up here and here you also have the email. Here you can add a note and here you can add an invoice note. This can actually be an internal message for your invoices when you get over to the invoice creator. So this part here, the upper left corner is hard coded. It's always there. But down here is the customized fields. If you would start a new, this would be empty. And in your company, you will have your specific fields, so they will not look the same. You might have a long list here. But in our demo database, these are the fields that we have. So the first one here is called project type and it's like a list. So you can select from a list. Here you have a field called agency and this is also related to your contacts. So you could just select somebody there, etc, etc. You can have date fields and say when is this going to air there, for example. So these are fields to give you general information about your project. And they are also very good because you can search uh, on these fields. And to conclude the creation of your project, you will just click OK. And then you will find it here in your toolbox again among your projects.